After initially coming together in the wake of this shooting attack, several lawmakers in some ways have become split again over the issue of threats, death threats in some cases that have been sent to some of these members of Congress. Unfortunately, my next guest knows too much about these dangerous threats. This man allegedly called Congresswoman Martha McSally, telling her to, quote, be careful when she returns to Tucson and that her days were numbered. Here now, Republican Congresswoman Martha McSally joins me up here okay. on the rooftop. How are it's you? It's mixed emotions right now. It, re it really is. Um, they just put up Steve's picture and yeah. announced him. He's not here with us. He's still in our prayers and his family. And But we're coming together for an American tradition. We're not going to be stopped. Uh, we're here you know, uniting as a team, as a Congress, and all the supporters. So it is, it is bittersweet. Tell me a little bit about what happened to you yeah. uh, with this person because it reflects on uh, the experiences that many people are having yeah. these days. Well, I also represent Southern Arizona, and in 2011, Gabby Giffords was shot, and we had six people killed, and Gabe Zimmerman, the first congressional staffer, killed in the line of duty in my community. And so we had this individual arrested pretty swiftly for three separate threats, indicted on three counts, uh, threatening to kill me.